The goal of the remote inspection is to ensure that we're delivering a good quality product to our customer. I mean, obviously there's, there's a huge benefit in reducing travel time and travel cost using this process. But the other benefit that we found, which was a little bit unexpected, was that it's often difficult when you're doing an inspection of modules to have all your engineering information also available to you at the same time. And by doing it remotely, it allowed the guys in the offices to be able to reference the 3D model, the PNIDs, or any other engineering documentation and have that instantly compared with what they were seeing on the camera. At the time when COVID-19 unfolded, George was building a number of crystallizer modules in China. It was very diverse locations involved. We had an engineering team in South Africa, we had a team in India working on it, I was based in Sydney, we had a client in Perth, fabrication in China. We addressed the issue by inviting our client to a remote inspection uh, via video link, and that involved our local uh, QC inspector having a, a camera which he would move around the modules very methodically and we would, we would normally do that using a, a PNID walk down as a basis. So we would select a line and we would ask our inspectors to, to follow along that line piece by piece and we would check all the details on that line. At site the modules have now been delivered and they went together really, really well. So. That is what we were, everyone was aiming for and we're really, really happy about that.